Imagine a universe so vast, it contains two trillion galaxies, each one home to billions of stars. It's a cosmic playground, where every speck of light might be a sun, a planet, a potential cradle of life. Yet, in this infinite cosmic arena, we stand alone with no signs of extraterrestrial life discovered. Despite the astronomical number of stars, the silence of the universe is deafening. This leads us to a fascinating conundrum known as the Fermi Paradox. So what's this Fermi Paradox all about? Well, it's named after physicist Enrico Fermi, who famously asked, where is everybody? Enrico Fermi was a brilliant Italian physicist, known for his contributions to nuclear physics, quantum theory, and particle physics. But one day during a casual lunch conversation, he posed a question that has stumped scientists and thinkers for decades Well, where is everybody? He wasn't asking about his fellow physicists, of course. He was referring to extraterrestrial life. This simple yet profound question sparked what we now call the Fermi Paradox. It's a paradox that tackles two seemingly contradictory facts. First, the mind-boggling vastness of our universe boasting billions of stars, each potentially hosting planets that could sustain life. And second, the deafening silence we've encountered in our search for intelligent alien civilizations. So, let's sprinkle some fun facts and trivia into the mix. Did you know that the Fermi Paradox isn't technically a paradox? It's more of a conflict between expectations and reality. We expect the universe to be teeming with life based on the sheer number of potentially habitable planets, but reality begs to differ. Or does it? Another delightful tidbit. Some theories suggest that advanced civilizations might be avoiding us intentionally. Maybe we're the galactic version of the noisy neighbors. So, where are all the aliens? Are they hiding? Or are we just not looking in the right places? Or maybe we are the aliens. Share your thoughts and theories in the comments below. Remember, the universe is a mystery, and we are all a part of it.